when you own your own car, you say, I want some ice cream. You hop in your car and you go get ice cream. When you're having to rent a car by the hour, you say, I want some ice cream. And you think, wow, that's gonna be, you know, eight to twelve dollars an hour to go buy that ice cream. You know what? I'm going to go eat those old cookies in the cupboard, and tomorrow my way home from work, I will get some ice cream. And so what we found is that people drive about 80% fewer vehicle miles when they have to pay in real time, by the hour, by the day, than they would drive if it was their own car parked downstairs. So we see people make economically rational choices happily. Like no one is complaining when they are doing car sharing. It just makes a lot more sense for them and they, they choose the, right, the financially correct choice. One of the beauties of Zipcar is that I feel that it demonstrated to the world that people's lives were improved and not diminished by doing something that instead of 15 cars, we had one car instead of 100, you know, 12,000 miles per person per year, they're driving 3,000. That that transformation happened very, very quickly, and people did it without any regret. It didn't diminish their quality of life at all. Mm -hmm.